The Enrique Yo plant in Garden Fault Zone is a system of coaxial left lateral moving strike slip faults which runs along the southern side of the island of Hispaniola, where Haiti and the Dominican Republic are located. The EPGFZ is named for Lake Enrique Yo in the Dominican Republic where the fault zone emerges and extends across the southern portion of Hispaniola through the Caribbean to the region of the Plant and Garden River in Jamaica. Geology The EPGFZ shares approximately half of the relative motion between the North American and Caribbean tectonic plates with the septentrional orientec fault zone which runs along the northern side of Hispaniola. Both faults merge into the Cayman Trench to the west. The fault accommodates about 20.6 plus or minus 1.66 mm of lateral motion per year. Additionally, a component of compression is present as the North American plate pushes toward the southwest. This results in vertical deformation manifest in the mountainous terrain of Hispaniola. Some researchers believe that the EPGFZ and the Septentrional Orient Fault Zone bound a microplate, dubbed the Gonev microplate, a 190,000 square kilometers area of the Northern Caribbean plate that is in the process of shearing off the Caribbean plate and accreting to the North America plate. Earthquakes a magnitude 7.5 earthquake struck southeastern coast of Jamaica in 1692, almost destroying Port Royal. An earthquake struck along the southern coast of Hispaniola in 1751. A magnitude 7.5 earthquake struck Port O Prince in 1770. The 1907 Kingston earthquake damaged every building in Kingston, Jamaica. A magnitude 7.0 earthquake occurred near Port O Prince, Haiti, as a result of seismic activity along blind thrust faults associated with this fault zone on January 12, 2010. Other historical large earthquakes in 1860, 1761, 1684, 1673, and 1618 are also likely attributed to the EPGFZ, though none of these have been confirmed in the field as associated with this fault. Monitoring A temporary Canadian seismic sensor network of three stations has been established in Haiti along the fault as of February 19, 2010. The network is not considered permanent but will remain for quite some time. The stations are in secure locations being expensive equipment and a satellite linked to Natural Resources Canada in Ottawa. They are solar powered so do not require grid connections. One station is at the Canadian Embassy in Port-au-Prince and has a permanent guard of one. Another is at the Jackmal Airport, currently run by Canadian Forces personnel. The third is at a Laogan orphanage, considered secure, but there are problems discouraging children from playing with it. The stations are roughly 50 kilometers apart. These are the first seismic stations ever in the country.